agriculture, food, and rides at the Ag Center. You'll find all of the above. The Mountain State Fair returns tomorrow, and News 13's John Lee is out there live now in Fletcher. So, John, a news conference is set to start in just a few minutes focused on safety? That's right, uh, and it already feels festive as you look out uh, on the midway here. You can see the flags uh, flying, very colorful scene. Workers in the background, they're feverishly working, uh, putting up the coveted stuffed animals that we'll all uh, try to win in the next coming uh, couple of weeks here or so. And uh, so this is obviously a huge process getting this all together. And in uh, just a few minutes, a big press conference focused on safety. And I pulled up a chair here to talk to none other than Agriculture Commissioner Steve Troxler. Commissioner, uh, welcome. Uh, pulled thank up you. a chair for you. Uh, spare no expense. Here, uh, <laughs> well, thank 13. you. So tell us about Safety and the focus here, uh, obviously, uh, it's a focus every year. Uh, how do you make sure this all goes together smoothly? Well, you know, it's all about partnerships. Uh, law enforcement, uh, Skyline Fire and Rescue, uh, all of our partners, and, and of course, we've got to have safe rides. So Commissioner Barry and her crew make sure that all of these rides are absolutely safe. So when you pull it all together, there's only one partner missing, and that's the public. You know, if you pay attention and everything goes according to plan, we, it, we'll have mountain fun for everyone. All right, sir, and uh, thank you very much. I appreciate your time. And, uh, again, the focus on safety today, and we'll have more on uh, the inspections and uh, look ahead to the fun here at the Mountain State Fair coming up later. Reporting live here at the Mountain State Fairgrounds, I'm John Lee. Back to you.